Alrighty, we're putting some new speakers in the back of my regular cab F-150 online. There seem to be a lot of videos about how to do it in the doors, and that's pretty easy. So I'm just going to show you how to do it in the back part behind this is a regular cab F-150, not an extended cab, so behind the seats here. Uh, there's six by eights back here. You can if you get in here and see it. I'm not sure if there's enough light or not. But those are six by eights. I'm replacing them with Polk two-way five by sevens, but whatever suits your needs is fine. Uh, here's the schematic from Crutchfield here. Let's see if you can see it here. The light's not cooperating. Let's take it to the other side of the truck. Basically, there's two main trim pieces that you're going to remove. Uh, the steps in order, I'll read them to you and then I'll show you briefly what they are. Uh, you fold back the back seat, pry open the seat belt cover, you can see it right there. Then there's, uh, let's see, there's a 15 millimeter nut you take off, remove the top of the seat belt. Uh, there's a couple clips, I'll show you here. So the first off, I'm going to remove the seat belt cover there. Then there's two clips in front of you, one's missing. There's the push pin clips. You can take a small screwdriver, push them in, and pop them out. And after you do that, you're going to go ahead and remove the top panel, will pop right off. That's the top panel there. You can see the two pins there. Now you'll have the bottom panel open, and there's a couple pins here. There's two on the back here. Those need to come off. There's one which is right here that's actually under this panel. When you pull it off, it's a smaller one. The other ones are larger. And this piece here is under the side of the door sill piece. So then you pull this up and this pops up. And then you just pop that whole piece. You just pull it out and see there's the other two. Of course, there's one missing. <laughs> and right there, this piece will come out. Then what happens is you get we can see it here on the other side. There's a top piece missing. You can see the adjuster for the seatbelt still, still there and where it bolts. And there's the bottom piece. There's the speaker there. We can zoom in a little bit. And it's pretty easy. It's not too hard at all. I thought it was more challenging than it would be. Um, also back here you'll notice some of the trucks have a storage compartment. You just remove three little bolts and it comes out and I actually have it, I don't know if you can see it, that little plastic piece over there sitting over there that clean, it's pretty dirty. But let me just show the schematic one more time. It seems to clear things up. And I hope that helps. Hope it makes sense.